Welcome to Cat and Raven Designs. I'm Cat, and I'm Raven, and we are joined today by. Well, if, if we're soap moms, then you're soap grandma. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm soap auntie. Okay. <laughs> I'm the crazy aunt. That's true. I'm right. soap nana. Soap nana. Yeah. <laughs> so my mom is here with us today. Hopefully this soap turns out so that it's not a great tragedy in front of my mother. <laughs> we are making an experimental soap today. We are, as you might be able to tell from our large bucket, working on a slab. This is, I think I described it earlier as an earworm of a soap design. It's a design I've had in my head since we most recently redid Big Bad Wood, where I want to use that technique to do kind of a Lisa Frank inspired neon rainbow tiger. Very excited to try this out. I have also been given permission to go buck wild with the hollow glitter. Yes. Seems Ooh. appropriate. So to go along with our neon rainbow colors today, I'm going to be using a fragrance called Rainbow, which we have used before in an exclusive soap. And I love so much. I bought two bottles of it. So we're going to be using up some of that today. And I have our slab oils. We have a ton of colors prepped off screen. So a quick run through of the colors we're using. Oh, you can see one of them. Yeah. <laughs> Since I will not have a ton of time to talk once we're going here. We are using all neon, so pink, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple are all neons from Nurture Soap. Then we're going to be using black iron oxide and titanium dioxide, both from TKB. All right, you ready? I'm ready. You ready, Mama? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right. Base oils. Got our sodium hydroxide by distilled water and sodium lactate in here. The big bucket. Let's maximize my space. All right, get that all burped up. So mom, we call that one over there, that's the junk bucket. <laughs> it's where we put all the tools in between using them so they're out of the way. Oh, you have. So mom, this must be kind of weird because you watch our channel and you've never been over here while we're actually making soap. I'm excited. <laughs> I don't know how different it is watching as it is seeing just the channel. Okay. Um, this is real time. Yeah, real time. All right. Here are all our colors. And I'm going to be pouring uh, <laughs> nearly up to the top on all these. So here we go. Don't hit the spatula. You're in my way, spatula. Off screen, she's doing the black and the, with the white. On screen, I'm trying to get this uh, mixed a little bit for her before she stick blends. Cause some of these will need to be stick blended. Oh yeah, no, it's a neon. They, oh they're yeah, they're gonna need stick blending. And I have already all the colors mixed up with some oils, and the fragrance is already in there. Yeah, don't touch. <laughs> don't need that on your hands. It's not fun. Yeah, no lye burns. You'll know. <laughs> You'll know if you have lye on you. Does it hurt right away? Um, it starts to sting pretty quick. Yeah. Like, I want to say within about a minute or so. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't really start to burn unless you have a lot on there or it's been sitting for a little bit. But yeah, within the first, like, minute or so, you will definitely feel a sting. Aware that it is happening. You <laughs> the sink. Yes. Okay. So I think I'm going to go through the rainbow. No, I'll start with white and then I'll go through the rainbow and then I'll do black glass. White, I barely want to blend. White is always the trouble child. Always. All right, let's get all these out of the way here. I am going to be pouring down one side here. Does that need to stay tipped now? Uh, it's okay for now. I was just curious. Blue. You see okay on shot? I'm going to do as good as we can with it being tilted. Okay. Blue. See, this is similar to something I do with Cameron's uh, birthday cakes uh, when he requests rainbow cakes. Pink. Black. 
as you may be able to tell, I had a little bit of an accident <laughs> while I was prepping everything. Um, I did spill, but I wiped most of it up. And now we're gonna get started on pouring. I've noticed that neon purple is a pretty dominant color. Yeah, it can be. I'm gonna pour some more off camera here. Makes me think of melted crayons. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out. I'll switch to my smaller one. All right, here we go. The stripe inside the container is really cool. Yeah, looks like an acrylic toy. You like your acrylic toys, don't you? They're pretty. I love them. How many times have you been like, oh, it's like an acrylic pour with our soaps lately? Because it so often is. So that'll be it for that part. <laughs> Woo! All right, that was a lot of work. It's very heavy. Okay, so now that this part is done, I'm gonna let that set up for just a minute. And in the meantime, I'm gonna mix up some frosting. Set this aside. Hopefully that comes out. <laughs> I don't know how much actual trust I have in it coming out. So I wanted to talk real quick about how we set up our piping bag. So most stick blenders come with this blending cup. So I use this to put our piping bag in. So I have the piping bag just sort of folded over on the inside here. And then I just drape the rest of it over. And that makes it really easy to then scoop your frosting in. It's like stiff whipped cream. Yep. With butter, if you've gone too far with your whipped cream. Okay. My husband's taking a nap. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got a closed star tip on the piping bag today. I'm just gonna go like so. Almost like rosettes. Yeah. Oops. A little stiffer than I was expecting. Maybe I should start here. Oh my god, baby. <laughs> You're so loud. Oh no, <laughs> I didn't make enough. Uh -oh. We may need to make a little bit more frosting. Maybe there'll be uh, some bars that just don't have it. <laughs> Should've made a double batch. Well, at least now we know for the next time <laughs> we do a batch in the slab that has a partial frosting. We know how much we need, which is not a single batch. <laughs> About one and a half. <sighs> Most of them will have frosting. Not all. Yeah. I did my best. <laughs> They'll just be a small section of oopsies. All right, well, now it's your turn. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Baby! Hi! You want to nap upstairs? <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Let me know when I'm good to glitter. So I'm making the possible mistake of letting Kat handle the top here. I've got um, Silver Hollow that I'm starting with. Hmm. Keywords. Famous last words. Hey, I'm only using two glitters. Only two. Only two. Does, does that have a liquid inside there with the, the glitter? No, it's no. just straight glitter. Just really? the powder. Yeah. It's just a really fine sure. hack. Next up. It's larger Hex Hollow Glitter, um, Into the Mystic from Mad Micas. Uh, I feel bad for that one little corner that doesn't have any frosting. Not everybody wants the frosting, I guess. So there we go. People that don't want the frosting get the extra glitter. Maybe those will be discount bars because <laughs> they don't have as much as the others. I'm so scared this is going to be really ugly. <laughs> really cool. I hope so. I'm just really... We've never talk, done... Talk yourself out of it. Okay, maybe, maybe uh, we do like Jackie and be like, pray to the saponification gods. There you go. <laughs> so they never destroy... Well, they rarely destroy our stuff. 
I don't know. Aquatic Vacation has done some weird things to some of our designs. Protect our soap from discoloration, <laughs> muddiness, and being too soft. Quit breaking our stuff. I think we talked about Lisa Frank in one of our videos previously, but uh, Kat and I being 90s and early 2000s kids are absolutely Lisa Frank <laughs> grew up with that. <laughs> Did you have anything like wildly colored when you were a kid like Lisa Frank was? Not that I can think of. I always kind of assumed there had been because you grew up in like the 60s, the 60s and the 70s. I don't know. I associated well, that with high pretty, dye, pretty that wild. That was about it. Because <laughs> the, 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 the name brands and things like that weren't, mm -hmm. that, weren't that big a deal. Yeah. They, they weren't in my house. That, that avocado green. <laughs> oh, yeah. We had a kitchen full of that <laughs> burnt orange and avocado green. <laughs> so terrible. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure we'll look back on the the choices aesthetically from the 2000s. We already do. Yeah, but like more so. Well, in the 60s, my mom's kitchen had the black and white tiles, mm -hmm. and then she had turquoise. Oh, everything. Nice. <laughs> I actually like that black and white turquoise. Me too. We should do a soap like that. And that, that lion's paw table used mm -hmm. to be turquoise. Oh, yeah. I remember you telling me that. Yeah, we have this, or not we, but my mom has this table in her house that has been my whole life, as far as I remember my back. My whole life. Yeah. It was made in about 1900. It's got lion paw feet at the bottom. I remember my mother sitting on the floor with um, dark pink nail polish, and she was polishing <laughs> the lion claws. The lion claws. <laughs> I don't know why that just seems very grandma. Just there we paint, go. Painting the lion claws on the table. <laughs> there we go. All right. You're feeling good on that? I think that's enough glitter. I'm not sure. I mean, I don't know if I'm really the person to ask for that. Yeah, it's enough glitter. Okay. <laughs> All right. Like wedding cupcakes. Yeah, kind of. That's funny. All right. Well, we will zoom in here. So here is our close-up on... This Lisa Frank inspired rainbow tiger top <laughs> with the um, sad little bars that aren't going to have any frosting on top. My bad. Well, live and learn though. So we're going to let these sit in the mold for bare minimum 24 hours. I'll check them tomorrow and see if they're ready to come out or not. And then we'll split them into slabs or we'll split them into loaves and then cut those down into bars. And mom, I'm, I'm sorry that uh, you will not be able to be here for that. I'll definitely send you pictures. Yay! Thank you for coming and hanging out with us today. <laughs> it was I, fun. Yeah, I hope it was at least mildly interesting to see the entire process. <laughs> but, I've seen it from start to the end now. There you go. Very rainbow on top with all that hollow. You can kind of see the difference in the hex size there. That Some of them are quite a bit larger than the others. So with that, we'll let those sit. Uh, if there's a YouTube ad, we'll let that run. Otherwise, we will be right back. See you in a minute. So we are back. Uh, Mom has returned. Could not resist the allure of seeing the cut live. <laughs> I don't blame you. Uh, I will throw up some pictures now because it's kind of hard to get a good angle with the volume of soap here of some of the sides of what it looks like. Pretty promising. Very excited. <laughs> Hoping for the best. Here we go. All right. Okay. Try not to get too dirty. Thank you. I know you do. I like being dirty. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's just a trick to get another bath. Yeah, probably. Boing, boing, boing. <gasps> oh, man! <gasps> wow! Oh, man! <laughs> Holy junk! Wow! <laughs> ah! <laughs> so excited! Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right, here we go. Number two. Oh, did I just? No, I didn't. Ooh, okay. Boing. Boing. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. We have to take it off. 
Okay. Can you leave them outside maybe if they're dirty? Thank you. Oh, oh man. Wow. Look at those colors. <laughs> wow. Holy cow. And you were doubting I yourself. I was doubting. I, I was full of doubt. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, my finger hit the wire that time. <laughs> Man, that is bright. Dang. I mean, come oh on. God. Look at that. This is the coolest part right there. Oh, I know, right? I can't wait to cut it. <laughs> so excited. And the last loaf and the mini bars. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> so excited! Oh man, okay. I might have to steal the camera for just a second. Go for it. Yes. Good lord. I mean, what? <laughs> wow, they are so bright and swirly. Greg. Greg's gonna come out of this like hyped. <laughs> Greg needs a bath again. Greg always needs a bath. Oh, oh so excited. <laughs> Greg, my friend, I hope you are prepared. Let's do this. Greg is prepared. Boing. Okay. Let's pull a couple out of here. Let's see how we did. Are we ready? And the reveal. Ooh. Nice. You know, I bet on different ends, too, the, the bars are going to be super different. Like, here's one that's a little closer to the other end. Oh, interesting. Oh, wow. Interesting. All right. Let's grab one of the other loaves. Try these two real quick. Oh, this one's... Okay. All right. Let's try one of these. This is closer to the end where it was being poured. Well, that was the opposite end. Look at that side, the though. Most poured. I mean, look at that. Oh, wow. Yeah. Crazy. All right. So this is one of the ones from the ends. Let's put a couple of these ones. Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Boy, every single one of these is going to look so wildly different. <laughs> That's a lot of blue. <laughs> <laughs> that is. <laughs> like tiger stripes at the top. That's cool. I mean, look at this sample piece. <gasps> look at this sample piece. Oh, 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 oh. oh man. Oh, he totally didn't listen to these Whoa. upstairs. Oh, That's neat. Of course he didn't listen to me. He's five. <laughs> what they do. Here's another good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh man. man. Watch. Me too. <laughs> I couldn't have captured all this on a video. I could have sent you on your phone. I would have been like, look at every single one of these. <laughs> They're all cool. You're concerned they are going to get too muddy. Yeah, well, you know, it was a lot of colors. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just surprised how much, like, some of them are... Oh, man, look at that! Nice! All of these are my favorite. <laughs> Oh, look at the little other side. side a little bit. Ooh. Look at the other side. So pretty. Oh, wow. Thank you, Mama. Uh -huh. I mean, this is a pretty impressive batch, if I'm going to be honest. It is wild. I mean, look at how different those, those two ends of the same loaf. Look at that. So neat. You know, I just want to show them all off because they're just so cool looking and so different. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I think uh, I can sufficiently say that it did come out well. Um, there's, a, there's a little bit of muddiness here and there, but it's not too bad. That one was really cool. Man, those are so neat. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Oh, wow. 
I, I say it's sufficiently Lisa Frank inspired. Yeah, I think so. Oh my gosh, these mini bars though. Ah. Alrighty, and with that, our finalized Lisa Frank inspired bars are looking neon and rainbow and all over the place. And oh my gosh, everything I could have wanted out of these bars. Look at even the mini bars look so cool. <laughs> so these will be available as part of our November release, which will be out on November 27th, which is a Friday. It is also Black Friday, and we do one sale a year, and that is Black Friday through Cyber Monday, where all soaps are $5. Obviously, mini bars will still be $2. We're not going to like raise the price, but high tops, low tops, everything will be $5. So we only do that for just those four days. That is the only sale we do all year. So we will catch you then on catandravendesigns.com at 8 a.m. on Black Friday the 27th, where you will be able to get your hands on some of these Lisa Frank bars. So with that, thank you again, Mama, for being here with us. Thank you for having me. I'm glad you came back to see the cut. <laughs> me too. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty awesome. So we will see you at the next video and hope you have a good day. Bye-bye.